So I'm back again. Um, Jessica can't do her video once again on time, so I'll be doing another video. So I got some good news and maybe some bad news. Mostly bad news. Um, uh, so in this episode, my web, no, fuck, my microphone is not cooperating. So. The bad news is the audio quality is probably going to be shit and dicks. But the good news is that at least you'll be able to hear me a bit better, hopefully. Okay, so here's May, and you know, she's going to ask you your Pokedex. How's it going? She ran out of balls. Huh. Yeah, whatever. But she doesn't want to fight you or anything. She's going pacifist for a while. But. You want to be on your way to. Err. Well, not Paddleberg City, but close. You want to go right near the edge. Near the water. Where you'll find Mr. Briny with his. Winkle. His Winkle. I don't think Jessica got the item up here. No, she didn't. Yeah. So it's a potion. We'll just save two hundred dollars. Okay, so now that we have cut, we can do a few more things in here. Namely taking another way down besides the way without grass. So there's this bitch. Oh, neat. That's a badge from Rustmill Gym. You must be a trainer. So she gives you a miracle seed. That's going to be great. We're going to give that to Snacks. Oh, okay. Awesome. Great. Boom, boom. Oh, shit. So yeah, the Pokemon are the same over here as they are in the areas where you don't need cut. Mm, and that's pretty shit because the Pokemon in here are pretty shit. <laughs> but it's okay because there's not a lot that they can put at a low level and have it make sense. That's a good Pokemon. So we got another great ball that's our third now and all the pokemon the wild pokemon are like still under level 10 so don't need great balls yet oh fuck i don't want to go in here i think i'm going to start cutting out the pokemon battles to make the uh the videos a bit more exciting and less shitty <laughs> and long and agonizing i'll keep some oh it's a slack off I'm gonna catch them. We're not gonna use them, but I'm gonna catch them because they're somewhat hard to find. That is, if I don't kill it. Yep. Fuck you! I better catch them on this turn. Or else we're gonna have a fuck of a time with Aether. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Stay in the ball. Boom, boom. Dude. Dude. Yep. Yeah, we got Slackoth! So Slackoth is an awesome Pokemon. He's one of my favorite from this generation. He's a slacker Pokemon. He's two feet tall, but he looks like carpet. Surprisingly heavy. So he lolls around for over 20 hours a day. Because it moves so little, it doesn't need a lot of food. It's Pokemon sold... What? That doesn't even make sense. Every day he eats three leaves. Wow. I would love to have a pet. Name him something very fitting. Awesome. I think that was a girl. Oh, and there's something here. That's a suspicious little hole. Also, I just uh, touched up the. Facebook page for the, our channel, so 
I'm gonna link that from now on in the description, and so will Jessica whenever she decides to start making videos again. And you gotta go check it out because it's great. So here's Mr. Briny just playing catch a dick with his fucking wingle. Um, so he says he owes you and you want to sail with him and we gotta deliver a bunch of shit. So yeah, let's set sail for Duford. Here you go, get in the boat. Woo! Get to watch this little thing which I used to think was amazing as a kid but now I'd really rather sit on the boat because that would be kind of fun. Mm, but whatever. So we gotta go deliver the letter first of all. That's the first thing we have to do. And after that, we're allowed to go to sleep port, but we're not gonna do that just yet because we gotta go to the gym. I also was thinking about doing this thing on our Facebook page, we've got a pretty cool cover photo. It's got our two current team members, and it's also got the silhouette of the next team member that we're going to get. So, if you guys can guess what our next team member is, whoever guesses them first will, I don't know, I'll, maybe I'll give you like a shout out or something cool like that. Um, whatever you want. You pick the prize, as long as it's free. <laughs> So, you go to our Facebook page, which I'll put a link to right now on top of that tentacle. Click the tentacle to go to our Facebook page. If that even works, I don't know. But, yeah. You go to our Facebook page, you'll click the cover photo at the top. And then, comment on it. However, you can't see the cover photo until March 30th. So, if we get them by then, I'll put the silhouette to our next edition. And you can guess that one. And I'll do it for the next one, next one, next one, next one. You know, like that. So there goes Ned with his one little tentacle. Alright, so Elliot will give you almost 500 bucks. Which can get, yes, you know, two potions or something else cool like that. Stardust. That is something you can sell for some money. Which is always good. And then over here, there is no item. I guess I'm a fucking idiot. Yeah. Okay. So, up we go. This guy gives you rock smash, I think. No. Flash. He gives you flash. Uh, helps you meet. He helps you do shit. Teach him move flash. It lights up the inky darkness. Use. Need the gym badge. And let's do that first to make things easier. Uh, yeah, let's go this way. Boop, 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 boop. Yeah, okay, so here's a do for Jim. Conveniently placed with the door in front of a bunch of trees. And I don't think this guy is actually useful at all in this generation. He gives you fresh water in the newer ones. But, nope. Fucking useless right now. Okay, so there's nothing over here. Um, I think there's a bitch up here. Nope, it's the next one. Nope, she's down there. Okay, I really don't remember this at all. So... This is a first trainee you'll encounter in the gym. Most of them use Meditites. Um, the gym leader, I think his name is Brawly. He might have a Medicham. I'm not too sure. I know he has a Makuhita. But uh, that's all I really know. <laughs> now, I, when I think about it, it's probably a Medicham. Too low level. That's like seeing Roxanne with a Golem. But, unfortunately not, because Golem is awesome, and she does not deserve one. Why is that unfortunate? Wait, I don't even know. What the fuck did I just say? But yeah, anyways. we Why aren't we winning this? I think Meditate is 
part psychic. I know that sounds. Oh, fuck you! Bitch! Okay, let's get snacks out of here. Smack you around. Come on. Absorb. Are you fucking me? Suck my cock. You can't. Oh, you dick! I'm gonna fuck you in the face eventually. Thank you, Jesus. Alright, what? That is impossible. Stop biting, you're not gonna have a fucking time. Okay, yeah, so drain that motherfucker's energy. Get some experience, grow a level. Fucking Aether is useless as dicks. And then we'll go heal Aether. BRB. Alright, so I forgot to mention before I left you guys there for a minute that after every trainer you defeat, the light hole circle -y donut thing there becomes bigger. Which is why I'm fighting this bitch. There's no need for Brawly to be involved. I'll crush you! Alright, so by now I've realized that uh, Aether is absolutely garbage, useless fuck on these Meditite. So... I'm gonna do the good old switcheroo like we did before. I was gonna make these episodes longer, but... You know, fuck it. I use goddamn my fucking quick attack, you piece of shit! You can't use first if I use goddamn fucking dick fuck quick attack. Dick. Fuck you. Alright, anyways. <laughs> So, these Meditite really aren't too much of a threat unless you have a little pussy ass Ralts. Not to name any one in particular. Aether. But they are kind of a pain in the ass to take out, as you can see. Your level should be around 15 ish. And you'll be good. As long as you don't have, like, a rock type and some other you know you'll be fine if not you can always train in the cave over there it'll be okay so all right just come on Asa. i think i might start skipping the gym leader battles after this or the gym trainer battles but i will put them on you know fast forward not just skip them so you guys can see what you got coming because you don't want to miss these why did I send out Aether and use an attack okay come on come back go snacks do it yeah do detect fail because it's the cheapest fucking move in the world I don't understand why you would use detect because you're gonna die the next turn or the third turn or fucking Uh, hurry up. Uh, I cannot wait until the next battle so I can stop commentating because I'm running out of things to say. It's not an easy job. It's really not. <laughs> oh, I'm not crying, you little fuckers. Okay, this is something Aether might be able to take in my chop. Because that is a pure fighting type. So confusion will kick its ass. And it's level 12. So, you know, hopefully we'll wish for the best. Go on, fingers crossed. Let's go. Yeah, we got this one. Lear. Oh, shit, you got me. You got me. You got me. I got you. Bam. Alright, so that was Aether's probably first fucking victory ever. And levels up. Great. Awesome. I love it. So Tessa comes flying, fucking floating little cunt bitch, and their light hole donut thing gets bigger, and then we go over here, waste a battle on this cunt ass, and I'll be right back.
So that was a pretty simple battle. Hideki. At least he's not a floating little cunt bitch. I think that might be the end of the trainers. Mm, mm, nope, wrong way. Yeah, pretty sure that's it for trainers. Okay, so I'm gonna go heal our little bros, and then I'll be right back. So we're back for the gym leader fight. Which is gonna be great, because we're gonna kick his ass. We got a psychic type and a grass type. He got nothing on us. So this is Brawly, do for the gym leader. I'll try to do an appropriate voice for someone who uses fighting type Pokemon. <coughs> I'm Brawly, Doofus Gym Leader. I've been churning the rough waves of these parts, not grown tough in the pitch black cave. So you wanna challenge me? Let me see what you're made of. So here's Brawly. Our long awaited second well not long awaited, but he's our second gym leader. Which is something to celebrate. Cause we're getting into the game now, guys. So Brawly's signature move is bulk up. You don't want to let him get a couple of those up because then you're fucked. You just want to go at him with everything you've got. Do not take the time to lower his defense or raise your attack or whatever. Just go at him because you don't want those bulk ups to get up. Because as you can see, he's a fucking asshole. So the only way to use Flash and have some convenience in our shitty lives is to beat this guy. And the closest place to train is the cave. Fuck you. And I've already lost him once. I had to fucking re-come back in here. I didn't restart, but I, you know. Oh. That's good. I didn't even realize I confused him. I was talking too much. Okay, hopefully this will knock him out. That went a lot, lot, lot smoother than the first take. And you'll get some decent, not good, but decent EXP. Jesus Christ, I don't like this. So I, this is main Pokemon. It's a Makuhita. And I don't know what I want to do. He's probably going to use a bulk up, so I will risk a potion. And if not, we've still got snacks. But you, this is a little fucker that you do not want to use bulk up. He will fuck you in the asshole. He's a dick. Literally and figuratively. Well, not literally. He's not a dick. He's a little human dude. Stop using that! Apparently that move is shit. I don't even know what type it is, but it's super effective and it doesn't even do anything for me. So maybe... maybe this will go smooth. Yes, it will. Because it looks like I've got the upper hand here. But I do not want to get, like, smacked around by some attack I don't know he has. Sand attack? Don't fuck with that! Yeah, okay, so this will be good. This is looking like a good battle. <sighs> I'm just really glad he's not using bulk up or anything like that. Because that would be the worst case scenario. I don't even care that he uses Super Potion. I'm glad I'm alive. I'm not too glad that I missed. But, you know. You take what you get. And I've got a shitty ass little bitch psychic Pokemon. And I'm doing pretty well with him, surprisingly. And his next hit's gonna kill me, so I'm gonna use a potion. Oh, yes. That's, yes, that's going to be, everyone pray to Jesus right now, oh, 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 fuck, I didn't get a critical hit, I gotta use my fucking potion again, uh, okay, so, oh, fuck, come on, why are you such a dick, suck my cock, alright, no, don't use potion, okay, so, this should be it for us, unless he gets a critical hit, and he didn't, so he's fucked. This is the end of Brawly's fun. Finally. He's a dick, and I hate him now. So, get one level out of that whole fucking gym. And Brawly's done for. Here he comes. Whoa, wow, you made a much bigger splash than I expected. 
You swamp me. Okay, you got me. Take this gym badge. And you get almost 2,000 bucks, which is pretty generous for a shitty gym leader. And then the whole room lights up. And what does that mean? We get flash and a knuckle badge. So you get a knuckle badge from them. The knuckle badge makes all of your Pokemon up to level 30, even though you get in trades, obey you without question. And you can use flash outside of battle. And then he gives you TM08, which I believe is bulk up. Is it bulk up? Yep, out. If you've got a tree or um, a torchic, don't teach him bulk up, because he learns that. Wait. No, no, no. He used focus energy. You can teach him bulk up. It's a good, it's a good move. I'm not one for setting things up in the main game, though. Online, yeah, but not in the main game. Alright, so we're going to go heal our Pokemon, and I'm going to end this because I don't know how long it is. And, you know, maybe I'll see you guys next time. I probably will because Jessica's not even going to be around on the weekend. Uh, and, yeah, whatever. I'll see you guys later.